A lot of people might recognize your voice with a voiceover on American Gospel. You gave a really helpful, clear explanation of what the gospel is. How did you get involved with that project? Yeah, so that was uh, that was interesting because the, the director, uh, Brandon Kimber, uh, who I had not met prior to, he reached out to me after I did Why We're Protestant, which is, again, a book on the solos and uh, an apologetic for Protestantism versus Roman Catholicism. So apparently he read the book and contacted me and said, hey, I'd like you to consider being in my movie. Well, I went home and I told my wife, I said, some guy wants me to be in his movie. And she goes, oh, don't do that. You know, and I'm like, yeah, I don't know. So he sent me a trailer and I looked at the trailer and it was really well done. And I was like, oh, wow. You know, so I, I looked him up and realized that he'd actually won awards and had done a lot of other work and was was actually a very prominent and, uh, and, and uh, talented writer and director. And so once I realized he was going to do that level of quality for the gospel, I said, well, absolutely. So I contacted him and I, then I begged him to take me at that point. Um, but then uh, had a chance. So I was at G3 uh, conference in uh, 2018, early 2018. And so we were able to connect and I sat down for only about an hour and just answered questions and just talked. And then I kind of forgot about the project. And then like a year later, the movie came out. And so it's funny because even now people will, will come to my church or they'll see me and they'll say, oh, I remember you from American Gospel. And I have to pause yeah. because I'm not I don't think about that. I think about my preaching ministry or my writing ministry and I forget sometimes about the movie. Um, yeah. But, you know, I think most people when they see they'll see my face and they, they don't know who I am. But then they'll say they'll see uh, Gilmanton Ironworks, New Hampshire. And most people have said I didn't realize there was a church in, in that part of New Hampshire. So. I think that's the bigger draw is that there's a there's a pastor and a church and a gospel witness in our small town. So uh, tremendous blessing to be a part of it. So thankful that it's doing things for the kingdom and that people are hearing the gospel and actually becoming saved by watching that movie, which is just such a great joy. And the fact that I get to be part of that is just tremendous. So, yeah, great.